St. Augustine said that the church has some that are not of God and God has some that are not of the church. The question came to us, how do we know if some of our other brothers and sisters of different denominations and different faiths, if they're going to be saved? Even asking the question that sometimes it seems like we say that only Catholics are going to be um, written in the Lamb's Book of Life. Well, let me just start out by saying a, a, a quotation from my patron, St. Augustine. St. Augustine said that the church has some that are not of God, and God has some that are not of the church. Meaning that the way that God saves, there's an ordinary way. And, and Jesus told us that ordinary way. But God has ways that we do not understand. I'm gonna give you some homework. Lumen Gentium, paragraph eight. Read that, that's what the Catholic Church teaches about salvation. We are saying that like the truth is something that calls to everybody's heart. And you can never have heard anything about religion and your heart still longs for that. And you can even find God just by using your noodle right here, your reason. And in fact, that's what's happened many times. But now with all these different denominations and faiths, look, to answer your question, what can we do to bring unity? It's very easy. Be holy, become a saint. Mother Teresa, she would go and she would mix in with Hindus, Muslims, Christians, pagans, atheists, but there was something about her that just like resonated with them. And people of all different faiths believed in it. It's not just about what you do, it's about who you are. I could feed millions of poor people, but if I do not have God alive in me, there's still gonna be something missing. Be holy and that will bring unity to the world. So you got some work to do. So do I. We'll work it out. But I'll be praying for you. God bless. Peace.